first so with no adjustments on my Singer 101. Pretty tight spacing right now. That's the upper thread. And back here, flip it over, is the bobbin thread. It's not too bad for no adjustments whatsoever. This is a sewing machine I bought for $10. And after tax and everything, it was $12.72. I did have to buy a power cable for it. I got it today and put it in to see how it would run. And it just sews nicely. That's full speed. Drop it back down. Now I will change the thread tension. I mean, not tension, but the threads per inch. That went up a little too much. Let's go a little lower. Now let's try it. It's not bad at again the upper thread and the lower thread. It's almost as though they just pulled the cord on it and threw the cord away because it sews like a singer very nicely. The cabinet's a piece of shit though. I'll show the upper portion of the cabinet. That's the top of the cabinet. It's going to have to be completely redone. Even the interior top is in need of serious repair. But at least I know it runs now. I haven't tried the light because I do not have a bulb for it yet, but it, I'm assuming it will work. If it doesn't, I'll take it apart and fix it. And that's my $12.72 Singer 101.